Bright skies and just enough wind power help the Southampton Boat Show get off to a swimming start. The event is the UK's leading outdoor social event showcasing boating and water sports, with everything from the entry-level boats to the top-of-the-range luxury yachts costing several million pounds. And despite difficult economic times, organisers claim this year's show to be one of their best yet, with many of the industry leaders choosing Southampton as a place to unveil their new products. The Southampton show is very, very special to the, uh, the UK industry and also that of people abroad. We have almost a thousand boats here, ranging from an 11 million pound uh, super yacht through to a 400 pounds dinghy, that, uh, so there's something here for everyone. I think what's so special about it is that this show, uh, many manufacturers, especially UK manufacturers, have chosen to launch their new models for the next year here at the show. We have nearly 30 new models, which is unheard of for a show of this size, um, being launched here, so we're very, very proud of that. One of the launches was World Marine's Cromarty 36 motor sailor. A classic boat from the 80s, it has now been reborn thanks to this family-run boating company. The Cromarty's are an easy-to-sail all-weather boat, perfect for cruising the waters around the British Isles. She's a beautiful cruising boat. She's long-distance, ocean-going category A. Equally, she's great just cruising around the local waters. Long keel, GRP construction, teak decks throughout, beautiful Sri Lankan teak decks throughout. Um, Sailing in two positions, you've got a, a helm position down below where you can be protected from the weather. But when the weather's good and the winds are good, you can be up here sailing. And you've got a fantastic, I don't know if you can see it in the camera, you've got a fabulous uh, area outside to sit in the sunbathe when you're at anchor. With classic good looks and expert craftsmanship, the Cromarty 36 has proved popular with both domestic and international sailors. We're in Ireland, so we're surrounded by water, and it seems to me that everybody in England loves boating, and I don't quite know why that is. I lived in London all my life, and yet here I am, I've been yachting for 40 years. She's also very popular abroad. We're getting lots of interest in Europe, from Spain particularly, from Italy, um, and from Greece. Um, in England, she's popular in the Scottish waters. Uh, I think because of uh, the weather conditions there, tend to be a bit varied. The super yachts may not be in everyone's price range, but the Southampton Boat Show prides itself on offering something for all its visitors. British manufacturer Laser Performance produces one of the world's most popular adult and youth racing sailboats. Part of the company's success is down to the boat's simplicity, which offers sailors of all standards and ages an easy way to experience the joy of sailing. We build boats to cater for all, all sailors and uh, many different abilities. So. The boat we start off with is the Bug, which is a single-handed, um, entry-level, rotor-moulded uh, sailing boat. Um, and the boats that we're the most most famous for, the boat we're most famous for, is the, is the Laser, which is relevant in all levels of sailing: clubs, schools, um, institutions, holiday companies. But obviously, the Olympics is where it's most famous, with the likes of Ben Ainsley, Paul Goodison, Robert Scheidt. I mean, it truly is an international class. And with Britain's continued passion for boating and more than 120,000 visitors expected at the week-long event, the industry looks well set to weather the recession.